Okay, there we go. So the chromosome uh, sits in the middle of every cell in the nucleus. And what's important to know about the chromosome, not only is this telomere being depicted in red right here, so I made this rope with red electrical tape, so this is the telomere. The telomere is uh, actually, uh, and is, uh, Jojo or Alex, you guys can hear me all right, right? You can see the screen okay? I'm just seeing some hands being raised. I just want to make sure. Yeah, everything sounds good here. Okay, good. All right, so uh, inside the chromosome is housed is the DNA. So the chromosome houses the DNA. So this is a chromosome being stretched out. The DNA is these little steps that look like a ladder. And the nucleic bonds where the colors come together, that's what the telomere is protecting at the ends. If that telomere wasn't there, then these nucleic bonds would separate, which would be damaged DNA. And damaged DNA would be like losing software in a computer. And here's the important correlation that you need to realize here with the DNA and the physical cell. The DNA is like the software that runs the physical cell. And so what's happening is the telomere is being compromised and these nucleic bonds are separating. So we could say that the telomere is degenerating and it's not being restored. Now, how many of you believe that the body can heal itself, right? And, and everybody agrees that it can. It has this innate ability to heal itself. Well, there's a geneticist by the name of Bill Andrews, who I'll introduce you to in a minute here. He knew that this should be healing itself. So when the telomere degenerates, it should repair itself. Just like when we cut our skin, the, the skin cells will communicate and they'll heal it up and that cut will go away. And we break a bone, same thing. Those bone cells communicate and they fuse back together and it heals the broken bone. Well, Bill Andrews knew on a much deeper level what the problem was, why they were occurring. And he was trying to understand why isn't it repairing itself? There's gotta be a solution there. And he spent his whole life dedicated to understanding that and trying to figure it out. And so uh, before we get to what Bill Andrews contributed and what he learned, as this telomere degenerates more and more, you can see the red, it's getting shorter and shorter. That would be depicting the telomere actually degenerating more and more. So as it gets shorter and shorter, you're exposing more and more of these nucleic bonds and they're separating. So the further you get down the line of losing DNA, the more software you've lost that runs the physical cells. And that shows up as the symptoms of aging and disease. It's Nobel Prize winning research. Every symptom of aging and every degenerative disease is linked to how much DNA is being damaged. Well, that's just, you know, the, the domino effect of the telomere first becoming degenerate. So the telomere first, then the DNA, and then the symptoms show up. And whether it's Parkinson's, lupus, ALS, thyroid disease, cancer, Alzheimer's, loss of vision, loss of hearing, osteoporosis, kidney disease, uh, uh, cardiovascular issues, pulmonary issues, uh, muscle atrophy, uh, skin issues, toenail issues. I mean, everything. They're all related to the loss of DNA. And the more DNA you lose, the more problems. And depending on which area that that's happening in, in your body, that's where it's going to show up the worst. Now, when it gets to a certain point, you've lost so much DNA, the cell shuts down. It's called senescence. It means death of the cell. And we're getting there faster than we ever have. And unfortunately, uh, the telomere is actually being compromised before you're even born. You've already lost DNA before you're born. That's where we're at today. How's that happening? The chemicals that get to the fetus while it's still in the womb and those chemicals that actually accelerate the telomere shortening. We actually have them in our foods. They, not the toxic like pesticides, those are in there and they do it. But we're talking about chemicals that man has put into the foods on purpose in the processed foods. They're called preservatives, trans fats. Those chemicals have been shown to shorten the telomere faster. Now they didn't know that. Back when they made processed foods, they didn't even know about telomeres and the role they played. This is more recent than that. Um, so when they made that inadvertently, the chemicals they were putting into the food were actually causing the cancer and the Alzheimer's and the Parkinson's and the lupus and the thyroid disease and the ALS and the MS and the everything. It's kind of like asbestos when they were putting it in breaks and in the walls of our homes. They didn't know that it caused cancer, but it, they, they found out 
well, you're learning this first here. This kind of presentation is not being done anywhere else but right here. So I put this presentation together and I've done over 3,000 of them in the last five years. So trans fats, shorten the telomeres faster. So if you're eating a lot of processed foods, then you're, you're shortening your telomeres faster. Well, pre-teenagers, front page of USA Today back in April 2012, their telomeres are 10 years shorter than they used to be. It's called accelerated telomere shortening. So they get here faster. Well, the Surgeon General said it's the first generation of children that won't live as long as their parents. Because they're, now the Surgeon General didn't say anything about telomeres because he didn't know. All right, it's just that we know. We, I put two and two together for you here. Eating processed food is getting you to senescence faster, which means you're gonna develop the degenerative diseases faster and you're gonna die at a younger age. And it's the first generation of children that won't live as long as their parents. So everything we see going wrong with this guy right here is a telomere issue. Now, uh, Bill Andrews is the geneticist that I was mentored by. There wasn't a whole lot of information about telomeres and, and more in depth about what can be done about it. Uh, so I learned a lot from Bill. And Bill in, uh, is the one who knew that this could be healing itself. And by 1994, he identified the gene in here that was being suppressed. It wasn't doing its job. And he invented the procedures and the processes for unsuppressing it in his lab with human skin cells. And he was able to do it by 1997 in his lab with human skin cells. What did he do? He activated the gene in this chromosome that produces an enzyme called telomerase. Telomerase repairs. And he unsuppressed it. It produced that enzyme and the human skin cells reversed the damage in them. That was the first time they learned that a human skin cell or any kind of cell you know, from a mammal could do that. But he did it in a Petri dish. And he got inventor of the year runner up for doing that. I mean, it was a big deal. They didn't really know what that meant fully, but what Bill and his colleagues had theorized because they saw the chromosome repair itself was what if we could do that in this guy, in all of his cells, skin, hair, eyes, organs, bones, brain, everything. What would happen to him if we fully restored all of his DNA? And their theory was he should go back to his mid twenties physically. Physiologically, he should be operating like a mid 20 year old he might be 70 chronologically but he should look and be behaving physiologically like a 20 year old because that's the kind of dna expression he's getting in his physical cells now they weren't off on that you guys and i'm going to get to that in a minute so uh this is me and bill andrews that's me about eight years ago and i had bill andrews just do a little endorsement with the presentation that i'd put together to help me with the medical professionals <laughs> I'm Bill Andrews, and I wanted to introduce this video to you. I've collaborated with Bill Andrews and been lecturing around the country about his research and product B. And Bill Andrews actually discovered the human telomerase gene back in 1994, and he was featured in Popular Science as the man who would stop time. So, Bill, what would you like to say? Well, I've listened to Dave speak many times on product B, and I endorse everything he has to say. So. I invite you to come listen to Dave MacArthur speak. Okay, so that did help. That helped quite a bit uh, to get into some offices and just the credibility because Bill's one of the, well, I would say he is the world's leading researcher when it comes to telomeres and, and activating that gene. In fact, his lab is the only lab in the world that can do what they do. They invented the procedure still even to this day. Now, what happened that made telomeres more of a, uh, not, it's not common knowledge. Most people don't even know they have a telomere even doctors included. I've lectured for doctors and pharmacists and dentists and chiropractors. And, you know, most people have not heard of a telomere yet. Um, but ABC News, what happened is Bill published his work and then Harvard picked up the research uh, from Bill's published work. And a Dr. Ronald DeFino was able to do what Bill did in the human skin cells. They were able to do it in mice. And this is the report on that. And now eternal youth. Is it in a cage around the corner? News tonight of a breakthrough for some pioneering mice. But we always wonder, what does a fountain of youth for rodents reveal for humans? Here's Sharon Alfonsi reporting. I feel tremendous. In the movie Cocoon, it's a swimming pool that turns back the clock for a group of senior citizens. But now researchers have found a way not just to stop, but reverse the aging process. 
The key is something called a telomere. We all have them. They're the tips or caps of your chromosome seen here in yellow. This is what it looks like in a young adult. But as you grow older, the telomeres become damaged and frayed. And as they stop working, we start aging, experiencing things like hearing and memory loss. Scientists took mice who were prematurely aged, added an enzyme, and essentially turned their telomeres back on. You can see it before the enzyme, after. Their brain function improved. Their fertility was restored. It was a, a remarkable uh, reversal of the aging process. Look at this picture. The mouse on the right has bad skin, gray hair, and is balding. But the one on the left had its telomeres flipped back on. And you could see that uh, essentially you now have a dark coat color, uh, that the hair uh, is restored, that the coat ha has a nice healthy sheen to it. Even more dramatic, the change in brain size. This is before the mice had 75% of a normal brain, like a patient with severe Alzheimer's. But after the telomeres were reactivated, the brain returns to normal size. So the more I researched on this and the more I learned from Bill that in the deeper, you know, I got into this, the more I realized this is a game changer for humanity. And when I had read the published articles on these mice, you know, and again, this is why it was given the Nobel Prize. Uh, it, was, it, it was released as the Nobel Prize right after this study was published and, and made public. Um, you know, this, my, the mice are not a Petri dish with human skin cells. They're living, breathing mammals. And so what happened when they activated this enzyme in the mice, let's say this is the DNA that's damaged throughout the mice and all of the different problems that are going on with the mice. There's way more problems that they saw that turned around than were mentioned in that ABC news clip. And this is where really, you know, I, I realized this is a game changer for humanity. Um, they saw the DNA repair in the mice in every cell. That's the first time they learned that a mammal could actually reverse this damage. The most that they could come up with was slowing it down, but the ABC News clip says, what if we told you you can not only slow down, but reverse? And this was the first time they learned that a mammal could do that. Now, it just made sense to me. Like, I didn't look for reasons as to why this couldn't be true. It just made so much sense to me. And uh, the deeper I looked, like I said, the more profound it got. And I realized that, you know, people don't know this and this could really, you know, allow me to be a game changer in the world with this information. Now, we didn't have any kind of product at this point. I started teaching about telomeres before we even had the product. So uh, Bill Andrews and his research team wasn't wrong when they actually restored the DNA in the human skin cells and said, well, if we could do that to that 70 year old, he would look like he's 25 again. That's what happened to the mice. Physiologically, they went back to a younger mouse because the gene expression was that of a younger mouse. And so this one was the same age chronic, chronologically as this one, but its telomeres were longer. It was the length of a younger mouse. And so the physical cells, and it wasn't just the skin and the hair, their bones were restored, their brains were restored. This is before and after. And right here, their brains were not functioning. They would have been in a nursing home right here. And all of a sudden they're operating at 100%. Their glucose levels leveled out. Their cardiovascular system was pumping like a young mouse. So obviously they're gonna become more active, right? Their muscle, their everything. And so then the Nobel Prize was given to that because it showed empirically, uh, you know, immutably that what was the case around this research around telomeres and the role that they played. So now we jump into Bill's lab since 1994, they have been trying to find compounds that we could use. Bill already knew this, you know, Bill already knew this before they did it with the mice. This was the thing that he had been dedicating his life to. He knew that this was the catalyst right here, telomerase. And uh, he got ridiculed by a lot of people. A lot of people, even investors were pulling out on him. One of the companies that, you know, were employed him, they pulled the plug on it. Bill had to create his own lab and his own procedures. And, you know, so he knew, so they had been searching for compounds to activate that enzyme that we could consume. And by 2009, they had tested over 304,000 different compounds, one at a time in the human skin cells. And they found eight that worked. These red lines are an indicator that that particular compound worked. 
and it was repairing the DNA in the human skin cells. Those were all toxic chemicals though. So here we are more than a decade later, and this is where they were at. And so enter the scene, John Anderson, founder and co-founder and formulator for Isogenics. And he's been a formulator of nutritional products for now over 40 years. He formulated for over 600 companies, nutritional products, Joe Weider. He was like Joe Weider's guy. Um, Nature's Way, GNC, Metrex, you know, Nature's Sunshine, all kinds of companies, over 600 of them, over 2,500 different health products. And uh, he didn't know about telomeres and telomerase. So Peter Greenlaw, who's an associate in Isagenix, got to know and understand who Bill Andrews was, and he had a brilliant idea. John Anderson's the world's leading formulator when it comes to nutrition. Nobody can do what he does. And so why don't I introduce him to Bill? Bill can bring him up to speed, and I bet John will be able to do something with him to overcome this challenge. And that's exactly what happened. John got so excited being interviewed, I mean, introduced to Bill Andrews. And that was not an easy task for Peter Greenlaw to get these two guys together. There's a whole story behind that. These two guys are brilliant. They're geniuses in their own specific areas of research. And to try and get people like that and to collaborate, it's just not an easy task. But Peter Greenlaw did it. And John gets so excited. He said, I would have formulated for telomeres a long time ago had I known about this. He's basically like, of course, I feel up. He said, I feel optimistic. I would have formulated for him a long time ago. Um, had I known the role that they played, he said, I had heard of telomeres, but I didn't know all of this about them. Now that I know, I believe this is the reason why I was born. Long story short, in the movie, The Immortalist, Bill said John started sending formulations over to him. They tested him in the human skin cells. Out of the first 15, they got a natural ingredient to get a hit in the human skin cells. There's a red line from one of the formulations that John put together and sent to Bill's lab. In The Immortalist, he says, we have to admit, he thought it was, we thought he was extremely lucky, like he hit the lottery somehow. What a lucky guy. But then he sent 15 more and got another hit. Out of 120, got these seven. The longer the red line, the better. Bill said this would change the landscape of human health as we know it. This is all natural botanicals, you guys. Nothing synthetic, no, no harmful chemicals. And John knows how to extract things from plants and put them together. That's a whole nother conversation. But John can do things that nobody else can do, just like Bill's lab. Bill's lab is the only lab in the world that can do this, even still to this day. And John has just continued to send compounds over. And I got a call from Bill early on. And he said, John did something I said would be impossible to do. Found two hits that went off the charts. That was put into what we call third generation. And now we're on fourth generation, which is way past all of this. There's over 25 hits, these red lines, in what we're currently taking. And it's all natural. I have my bottle right here. And uh, uh, it just doesn't even have a childproof cap. My 18-month-old granddaughter opened it and spilled them all out. You know, there's, there's no harm. It's just natural, water-soluble. But the thing here is that this is nutrition. And this is nutrition that's specifically been formulated through extraction and, and synergistically putting things together in a way that John, that only John knows how to do. And he did it for the foundation of our health with telomeres because of being introduced to Bill Andrews. You guys, this is a divine connection. This is no coincidence. This is no happenstance. You know, I truly believe that these guys were born. John Anderson actually said, I believe this is the reason I was born. And uh, Bill, you know, his research, he believes it's the reason he was born. So bring them together and look what happened. Science meeting wellness. And uh, man, we've been changing the landscape of human health just like uh, Bill Andrews said we would. And I was in Bill's lab, uh, I don't know, it's been a couple months now. These are these little bottles right here. There's hundreds of them. Uh, like I said, there's over 25 hits in what we're currently taking. Well, they found more hits uh, uh, out of, uh, that's not even in the product yet. This one right here is a really special hit. John texted me the picture of this one and he said, wait till that gets in there. This one's a game changer inside the game changer. Um, so that's Bill, that's myself. And this is Lancer. Lancer is the one who invented the procedures to do what they do. And Bill said, make sure that Lancer starts getting a lot of credit. You know, you've been giving me the credit over the years. Make sure that Lancer, he's probably the most, one of the most intelligent scientist alive on the planet right now and he's the one that invented the procedures to do this 
So there you go. This is all validation, you guys. This is scientific validation. It's all nutritionally um, put together. It, you know, and being nutrition, we can't make any claims around curing any illnesses or diseases. Um, you know, the FDA monitors nutritional companies to make sure that we're not saying, hey, take this product and it'll get rid of your diabetes or your osteoporosis or whatever, right? That's illegal to do that. And uh, if we try to take that on, we would lose. And so I'm going to put this disclaimer out here. We are not making any claims around curing any illnesses or diseases. And let's make sure we take that seriously. There were some people in Australia that actually did make some claims. They put it on the website and the government shut them down. Luckily, after four months, they allowed the product to come back under strict regulations. All right, you guys. So, you know, Jojo, Alex, I don't know if you want to uh, speak to this at all. You know, this, you know, Jojo, you were around. We've been working together for 14 years, just about. And, uh, you know, you got to watch this happen as well as I did. And, you know, mm -hmm. Bill Andrews personally. Yes, it was it was an exciting time to watch the whole thing. But um, really important to remember that, like you said, the body has the innate ability to heal itself. The body is the miracle. It knows what to do. The thing that we need is the things to put in it to help it to do its own job. So when we give it the chemicals and the bad food and the stress and the environment that's around us, all of those things affect the way our body you know, can heal itself. So when we give it the things that it needs, sorry about that, it's the... Um, it's the body that's the miracle, not the product. The product just helps the body to be more of the miracle that it already is. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay, so let's, uh, and Alex, I don't know if you wanted to say anything or but I'm gonna move on if you do, just speak up. Um, so I wanna go into some observationals now. And you know that's why I like to put the disclaimer right here. I'm just gonna share some observationals and without making any claims around anything, but it's about quality of life and being able to enjoy your life. And especially the older we get, you know, the baby boomers, and, and, and I'm finding this though, cause I've been doing this for 14 years now, full time. And what I'm seeing is pain and energy are the biggest culprits. Those are the two biggest things that are plaguing humanity. A lot of people might say weight loss, yeah, that's up there but pain and energy far surpass that because that's what's really affecting people's quality of life, right? And so this is about quality of life and allowing the body to, you know, have the opportunity to get better as we're getting older when we introduce something like this. So Molly and, and Bill Andrews, the geneticist, uh, they're ultra marathon runners, and this is Molly, and she ran this race two years earlier. And what we noticed was that endurance and that stamina and the recovery, it goes off the charts. Every athlete will eventually be on this. The ones that are on it now, they have a cutting edge over everybody else. But she ran this race two years earlier, didn't make it to the finish line. And then she gets on the product and she decides, I'm going to run that race again. She's the first female and the seventh person to get to the finish line. It's 138 miles long and it starts out at 13,000 feet and goes up to 18, back to 14, back to 18 and back down. And they only give you 60 hours to get to the finish line. So you're running straight the whole time, no sleep, no naps. You're running, it's an endurance run, 138 miles. She completed it. And she showed up on our stage two days later, two days later at our big convention from the Himalayas, straight from the airport in her sweats, talking about it. Um, Bill Andrews did it the following year after being on the product for over 60 years, or, uh, for being over 60 years old, he's the oldest person to do it. He had been on the product for over a year by, at that point, and uh, he did it in just over 50 hours. He said, I'm breaking records I set back when I was 20 or 40 years old, 20 years earlier. One of them he beat by 50 minutes. That's not a fluke, you guys. And so we notice that. It's something that you notice with endurance, but it's not just for athletes. It's for somebody who's having a hard time going up their own stairs in their home, or maybe they can't keep up with the, the kids at Disneyland, or maybe walking in the mall, they're looking for each bench that they can sit on. All of a sudden, people can't keep up with them anymore, and they're playing tennis now, and they're gardening again. It's just awesome to be able to be, able to be a part of that kind of catalyst in people's lives, you know, because of sharing this. I picked up motocross at 46 years old. I had never been on a motocross track and I hadn't ridden a dirt bike in like 25 years. At 46 years old, I picked up motocross because I felt so young and vibrant and, and I thought, why not? I always wanted to do it. 
And uh, I started beating teenagers out on the track and I learned how to do it. And I ended up in the ER one time and uh, the nurse said, honey, when you get to be our age, you don't do this anymore. We don't heal as quickly. And I'm like, well, I just started like a couple weeks ago. Give me a break. I love it. You know, and I did heal very, very quickly. It's one of the things we notice with this product is the cell communication and its ability to course correct much faster. It's blowing the medical community's minds on how fast the body's actually capable of repairing. And uh, unfortunately, I had a bad accident in the motocross. Uh, uh, I shattered this leg. The doctor said I'd never run again. He said it would take up to a year before I could stand on it. It literally shattered it like glass, you guys. It's the worst kind of fracture you could have. I was in bed for six weeks. But in three months, I was running stadiums. In four months, I was back on the dirt bike. It's like it never happened, you guys. My body is fully 100% restored. And, and I was not on my feet for, uh, let me get back to that, for, uh, it was three months, so two weeks shy of that. What is that? 10 weeks. I wasn't on my feet for 10 weeks. Two weeks later, I'm running stadiums, and I didn't even have any muscle atrophy because my DNA expression didn't change because I was supporting my DNA while I was laying in bed and not on my feet for 10 weeks. The muscle, and it was a PA for an orthopedic surgeon that noticed that. She said, first of all, that's impossible with a pilon fracture to be running stadiums. Come on, in three months, those little pieces can't heal up that quickly. I've had PTs tell me the same thing. So, um, you know, and we're hearing all kinds of stories like that. It's not a fluke. Uh, this gal right here, I love this Facebook post. She went from being in a wheelchair to hiking eight miles. And she says, that's a major victory because I didn't think I'd ever be able to hike again. And she said, right here, tears were streaming down my face. And she said, not only did I crush the eight mile hike, I could still move the next day. And that's one of the things that we noticed. The soreness isn't there, the stiffness, and you're just ready to keep going like you did when you were younger. Uh, this is uh, Amy right here in Stan. And Amy came to a meeting that I did at a dentist office in Wisconsin. She said, when I left that meeting, I had a whole new perspective on aging. And I got my father-in-law on it whose next step was the nursing home. And uh, he's 82 here, he's 83 here, he's 85 here and he's 87 here. And he's 89 right there. I mean, you guys, he didn't go he to the- just went, You know, he just did 101 pushups on his 89th birthday to commemorate his birthday. He was only gonna do 89, but he did 101. Not too shabby. <laughs> For somebody that couldn't even get around and he was tied to tubes in his house and tripping over them. And yep. And he's thinking about getting married now. He said that when Jojo and I were out in uh, Minnesota, we were doing some meetings with him in April. And he said, you know, I'm starting to think about getting married again at 89 years old. So this is the power of the human anatomy, right? That innate ability, anything that's living wants to thrive. And God has put into it innate ability to thrive and overcome the issues, right? However, we just haven't supported the body to overcome those issues on this level ever before. And so now you're going to be seeing things that might make you skeptical or think that that's unique, but they're not unique. This is just what's happening now. This is normal. This is the new normal. Uh, Bob Sheridan, early on, the product was released in 2011. He was sent home from the hospital right here. They said, there's nothing we can do for you. Your cardiovascular system is too weak to even work on. Just go home and get the paperwork ready. Now, Bob Sheridan is very famous around the world. He's the only boxing announcer that's in the Hall of Fame, and he's known as the Colonel. And six months later, after getting on the product, thanks to Dennis and Sharon Allen, who knew Bob personally, this is him six months later, back to work, announcing boxing matches. And they, they're like, Bob, what in the world happened? We thought we were going to lose you. You were just in the hospital. They could not believe it. And all he did was talk about this product right here. And he got permission from the Boxing Federation to go ahead and share that product with any of the athletes. And this is him sitting in his recliner at home. He's still announcing today, you guys. He's in his 80s. They interviewed him and he said, I feel like I can go on announcing for another 20 years. Quality of life, right? Um, oh, and I, I, I do forget to tell the story. He bought a sports car and got a ticket going 120 miles an hour. I mean, how cool is that, right? Uh, this is Minnie and Jojo and I stayed uh, at her farm home quite a few times. 
Uh, we've done a lot of lectures out there. And uh, she's laying down flat. She's 80 years old. You can see the curvature in her back, just very de de debilitated. And you know the body can course correct, you guys. She's 80 right here. She's 83 right here. And when I met her, her chin was stuck to her chest. She couldn't lift it up because it was just too awkward. And uh, here you can see the chin is off of her chest and uh, just amazing results. Uh, Angel, uh, who may be on the presentation here tonight, I just love this Facebook post. I mean, who wouldn't want to be 40 years old and told that you look like you're 25? You know, a lot of people don't, you know, believe Jill Bowman when she says, uh, yeah, I'm 60. This is, she's 60 right here. 2019, she's 60 years old. She said, I show people my license and they still don't believe me. Like it's a fake license or something. You know, so 2011, 2019, and she says, I have not missed a day of my isogenesis, call it ISOG. So, uh, and people are getting started on this in an unprecedented rate right now. You know, words getting out there now. There's this thing where in marketing, you get more and more people on it. And then when you get enough people on it, it explodes. And that's just right, we're right at the beginning of it exploding right now. Uh, this is Kathy. Kathy's probably on here tonight, and most people don't believe that that's her. In fact, Emily's friends didn't believe that this was her. And, and then Kathy comes into the conversation and says, yeah, in fact, that those pictures are of me. That's at Fitness America in Las Vegas at 69 years old. I just turned 70 in May. She's actually 70 right here. And she says, I really do feel like I've been aging backwards. What else could I possibly give the credit to? Thank you, John Anderson and Bill Andrews. So uh, again, the body is the miracle and it just has this uncanny ability to you know, do what God intended it to do. And what we're doing as mankind is destroying the body. Think of young kids today. Their telomeres are shorter than they've ever been. So we're actually destroying the body. And here we have something that is actually restoring. What would you do? What would you rather do, destroy or restore? Uh, Chantel, you know, a mom of three, couldn't sleep at night anymore because just too much back, you know, discomfort. She couldn't sleep at all, zero sleep. And she's had, you know, that back discomfort for a long time, but it got to the point where she couldn't sleep anymore. She gets on the product, Amanda and I get a text from her, and she says, is this a fluke? I slept all night. I've been crying in my bed all morning, and uh, I, I slept all night, and my back still doesn't hurt. She thought it was a fluke. She wouldn't say anything about it on social media until a month and a half later. And uh, now they're hiking. I see them out on the boat now on Facebook. And, you know, she shared it with her daughter who had scalp issues. And she said in the wintertime, it just is so raw and red and it literally seeps that they can't even brush her hair. She has not had any issues ever since getting on the product. Uh, my daughter, I put on it when she was 12. And everybody in her dance class asked her what she was on within three days. Within three weeks, the owner of the studio got on the product. And then Carter, we put on it, and his school teacher called three days later and asked my wife, what did you do to Carter? <laughs> Literally, what did you do to Carter? It's not just for people who are experiencing these obvious health challenges. Everybody has telomeres, and they're shortening at an unprecedented rate. You know, as far as statistic goes, Madison and Carter, Carter, excuse me, their telomeres were shortening while they were in the womb. And so, yeah, they're going to notice a difference when we start supporting those telomeres. And Carter takes the product on his own. Here he is making a shake, and there's the isogenesis before school last year. Uh, Benny was in a car accident. Trauma can damage telomeres as well, so can stress. But trauma, uh, his arm was stuck for four years. He couldn't move it, and he lost his speech motor skills. And the gal that shared it with him, they're showing her here. Check the strike. Holy moly. Yeah. Three weeks earlier, he wasn't moving that arm. She can't believe it. Nice. And now he's playing the piano and speaks in sentences, guys. So the body, again, is just, we're learning more about the body. Like, we really know more than pretty much everybody on the planet about telomeres and telomerase and what the body's capable of doing. This is the only product on the planet that's doing what this is doing. It's the only one. There is no competition. There have been copycats that have shown up, and John Anderson made Bill test them. None of them had any uh, telomerase inducers. They didn't produce any hits, uh, false advertising with those products. Um, and I asked Bill the last time I was in the lab, I said, are you guys still the only lab in the world that can do this? And they both said yes, simultaneously. 
So there's the science of telomeres, you know, that's the long and short of them, and <laughs> pun intended. Do you want long telomeres or short telomeres? I, you know, I love what Jill says, you know, I'm 40, and she just had her birthday, she's 48 now, and she says, I still feel like I'm in my 20s. I mean, how awesome is that? And she's like, do you want long telomeres or short telomeres? Wait, first of all, do you know what a telomere is? Okay, let me get you up to speed on what a telomere is. It's just the most important part of your human anatomy, so let me tell you a little bit about it and then what you can now do about it, because we have an asset to support telomeres nutritionally, two pills in the morning, two pills at night. This is a one month supply right here, you guys. Bill Andrews said it will become a household name. Every household will be on this. And then because of the results that we were seeing, he called it a phenomenon. He said, I'm seeing so many different results from people that are reporting directly back to me, it's a phenomenon. And he said, I believe that we'll get the Nobel Prize for this product. And I believe hey. that. Oh, sorry, go. You gave no, me a window. I was going to hop in. I was just, I just wanted to say that, um, you know, when you realize that, um, you know, we live in such a society that is like, you know, speed, speed, speed. Let me take a prescription and feel better in one minute, right? And so when we think that, when we put something in that nutritionally helps our body cellularly, it can take 120 days to infiltrate every cell in a healthy body in a healthy body. So we have to remember that, you know, everybody is going to sort of have to have a different pace with this. And since you were kind of doing testimonials, I thought I'd throw my mom's story in. Um, so my mom, I, I started her on the product like way back in the very, very, very beginning. She was actually like one of the first people ever, I think, to, to actually um, put it in her mouth. But she, um, at two weeks, tried to give the bottle away because she said, this isn't working for me. And so I was like, look, mom, I'm paying for it. You take it. Don't give it away because you have to, you don't understand what this is doing for you. Just keep taking it. So it wasn't until about almost four months in when we noticed her first improvement, um, which was, uh, you know, watching her, her short term, like detail recall be a little bit better. And then at six months we saw you know, some, some issues she was having with her lungs improve. And it, at a year we saw her, her, you know, the balance in her hands and a little bit of her, her hand shaking that went away. So those things had we not stuck it out and she would have given up that bottle at two weeks, we would have never been able to see the things that happened for her. So as you know, when you think of, you know, the product going in and working with your shortest telomeres first, we may think we know what that is because we can look at somebody and go, well, you're wearing glasses or you have gray hair. So maybe that's where your shortest telomeres are. But, you know, perhaps it's somewhere different that we can't see and we don't know that. But you've got to let the product work for you. You have to let the product work for you because everyone has telomeres. Everyone's aging. Everyone's in degeneration. Every single person, I would say 99.9% .9 is an accelerated shortening. So it's just a matter of putting it in and letting it go to work for you. Yep. Yeah, no, in today's environment, if they're not on this, everybody is in accelerated telomere mode, accelerated telomere shortening mode. There's no question about it. Uh, even stress, shorten your, short, it's, it can shorten your telomeres the fastest. Look at presidents of the United States and how old they look four years later that amount of stress that they take on ages them because it's shortening their telomeres faster because stress has been shown to do that. So yeah, great stuff, great information there. Um, you know, there's probably two words that you learned tonight, telomeres and telomerase, and now there's an asset for them. This is, there's a lot of value in the, the education that you just received just now. And you know, it's, it's hard to really retain it all but I believe that people get a good enough understanding of what's going on here and the value behind that. But we have it on YouTube and you can watch it over and over. You know, people have seen the presentation over 15, 20 times and they still learn something every time they watch it. So let's move on to the second part of this forever pack, right? You are what you eat. And so could changing one meal, could replacing one meal change your life? And the question is, absolutely, if it's this meal right here, because the mind that made this, and just think about this, 20, up to 40 researchers in over a decade couldn't do what John Anderson's mind was able to do single-handedly. And that same mind that put this together is the same mind that put this together. And this is unparalleled nutrition, clinically proven unparalleled, and also observationally.
So let's just go into a little quick uh, uh, education on this. I, I spend most of the time on the isogenesis. That's just the, you know, that's the, that's the game changer for humanity. It's the breakthrough. Uh, this has been, uh, John Anderson created this back in 2002. It changed my life in 2005. And it's changed a lot of people's lives ever since. So uh, you look at Nancy. Nancy in her 70s knew she was going to die. Kind of like uh, Dick Sauter, the guy that said, I knew the next step was the nursing center. She's working out in the gym here. When I had talked to her, she said, I'm thinking about being a fitness competitor again in her 70s, just kind of like Kathy. Uh, you know, this gal here, um, Heather, she released over 100 pounds. No hanging skin. It's not a diet, you guys. This is not a diet. It's a healthy lifestyle. And when you get the body all of the nutrition it needs, it's balanced and it becomes healthy. And you can see, you know, this is 90 days right here for her. Great body transformation, but look at the brain transformation, the attitude. That's brain chemistry, serotonin, oxytocin, dopamine. That's all produced based on nutrition. And you can just see it. You can see it from there to that, you know? So looking from there to that. Uh, now Everett, he was too skinny. He's 82 years old. He used the same products that they're using to release the weight, but he gained weight, 14 pounds in 30 days. He was 112 pounds when he started. That's Everett, 82 years old. And Chase, you know, a teenager, same problem, but he's a teenager. He's not in his 80s. It's very difficult to put muscle on an 82-year-old. We do it all the time because of the quality of the nutrition and the way it's put together and the way it's assimilated. And, but Chase couldn't put on the weight. I was just on the phone yesterday with Guillermo, who's probably on the presentation here tonight, a young man that can't put on weight. He's in the military. I know he's going to put on muscle because I watch it happen over and over again. He put on 14 pounds, uh, Chase did. So, and, and he's using the same products that they're using to lose the weight. It's a, it's a healthy lifestyle. It gets the body to homeostasis. Jill, she released 131 pounds, no hanging skin. Was it Dr. Oz, I think it was, that didn't believe her? Took her behind the curtain at an expo and inspected for any scars from the surgery. She didn't have any scars because there was no surgery. The skin becomes more elastic because it's getting the nutrition. Jeff Beebe in his 50s. This is Heather in People Magazine now as a health coach. I love this picture right here, Kenya, 438 pounds. We have over a thousand people with their pictures on the wall. These are just the people that have reported it. I personally helped two people release 100 pounds whose picture is not on that wall at corporate. They have over a thousand people who have lost 100, 200, 300, and now 400 pounds. And they keep it off. And uh, who could say that? What other company on this planet could say we've helped over a thousand people lose over a hundred pounds and keep it off? Well, this is Kenya today. This is a recent Facebook post. And she's saying how she appreciates she could sit in a car now and not worry about getting stuck. People Magazine, Isogenics. This was uh, just last year. So the problem with the nutrition is that it's nutritionally bankrupt. Do you know that we now have statistics of percentages of kids that are malnourished in the United States? We're not a third world country, but we're nourishing the body like we are. And, uh, you know, it's not that we don't have enough to eat. These kids are getting plenty of calories. They're not starving. They're just starving of nutrition. And because they don't have the minerals in the nutrition, the body's becoming acidic because the new minerals are what make you alkaline and gets you pH balance. It's called homeostasis. The moment you drop below 7.0, your body's becoming acidic. And how does that happen? Not getting the minerals. And the minerals are not in these foods. Even if they advertise that they are, they're not, you guys. That's not even a regulated industry. They could have less than 10% of the nutrition that's on the label. Less than 10%. And trust me, Flaming Hot Cheetos and, and donuts, they don't have the, the minerals in them. So we're becoming acidic. Most people are gonna be below seven, which means now you're in a state called acidosis, which means your body's gonna rob your bones and organs of those minerals to try to get you back to pH balance. So uh, just an example of even not just processed food, but even our produce doesn't have the minerals today. 
you know, I feel like we're educating people on this for the first time, you know, but this is old news. Just a lot of people don't take the time or have the time or even know to look. But one bowl of spinach used to give you enough iron for a week back in 1953. This is spinach right here in the U.S., according to UCLA. 2007 takes 51 bowls of spinach to get the same amount of iron. Iron is a mineral that your body must have. There's about 60 different minerals that your body has to have the adequate amount at every meal. Not just 60 for the day, 60 at every meal. And then your other key vitamins, amino acids, and fatty acids. So thank you, John Anderson, for putting together the perfect meal. It has everything. You need about 90 nutrients going into the body, 60 of them being minerals, to get to homeostasis. There's over 200 active ingredients in this shake. There's no meal that you could make, uh, first of all, because the minerals aren't going to be there. But there is no meal that you could make that would be this nutritionally dense and be able to take it all at one time. And then this is enzyme active as well. So the delivery system is built into it. John's a genius. And it makes you feel better. John Anderson said, I can make people feel better in three to five days guaranteed. And I felt amazing by day three. Um, you know, and my pH, it's always in the sevens. Uh, who was it that just, oh, Digna, she texted me this morning that she heard P, she's pH balanced. Uh, Guillermo, who's released 33 pounds. Now I released 53 pounds because of this nutrition uh, uh, 14 years ago. But uh, Guillermo, he says, I'm, in, I'm pH balanced now. This is unbelievable. I'm pH balanced now. He said, I'm exactly at 7.5. Been on the products for just over 30 days. You know, here's my kids and my grandkids. We're three generations in the isogenics now. Uh, my granddaughter, who just walked by with uh, my son and my daughter-in-law, they just left the house, but uh, we're over here to visit. You know, Cosette's been on the shakes since she could drink it out of a sippy cup. I was just uh, feeding their uh, baby that's not even a year old, uh, giving her, she doesn't even use a sippy cup yet, she can't. And she just is, loves the shake. They said, watch her with the shakes. When we give her shakes, she goes crazy, and she did. Um, Cosette spit the candy out that they gave her and said, caca. Why? Because candy is acidic and her body's alkaline. And alkaline bodies don't crave acidic foods. It's like oil and water. They don't mix. So, you know, and look at London here. She's going for seconds on the shake. She already had hers that morning. And then she saw mom. Mom was drinking her own shake and she saw the cup and came over. They love it. It's, it's you know, that's their body craving it. And, uh, you know, it's a big difference when you crave something that's nutrition versus something that's, you know, a processed food. Of course, it's gonna make a difference. Um, so you can watch this presentation in 22 minutes at foreverpack.com. You know, this is valuable information for people, for humanity. And it allows you to share this with people without having to wait for us to do this every Monday night. This is 24 seven, you can access this at foreverpack.com. 22 minutes. And it just goes through the science. There's no observationals. I just wanted people to see the science and not feel like we're trying to convince them or, you know, uh, you know just pure science. So let's finish up with, you know, there's this comparison here. This is probably the number one meal sold in the United States. There's a lot of Burger Kings and McDonald's and Wendy's out there. Um, in fact, when we were in Africa, there was McDonald's at Africa. Um, so let's just compare the nutrition calories and cost. Now I did this back in 2007. So the cost is going to be 2007's cost compared to one shake from isogenics. There's no nutrition in this. And not only is there no nutrition, it's going to cause you to go acidic, which means your body's going to rob yourself of the bone, your bones and organs of the minerals that are in them. It actually will leach calcium from your bones trying to offset the acidity that this meal caused. That's why osteoporosis is happening to pre-teenagers now. Um, maximum nutrition, more than what you need to be to homeostasis. 1,830 calories, 240 calories. So remember I said that there's now studies where they're showing malnourished children in the United States. It's not due to a lack of calories, it's due to a lack of nutrition. That's what makes you mal malnourished. We're the most overfed, undernourished country in the world. But here it's the exact opposite, minimum calories, maximum nutrition. And then this was $8.47 back in 2007. Uh, ours is under three bucks a meal. It's like $2.85.
it's you guys it's like willie says a no-brainer you could take your brain out and not even use your brain and it still makes sense let's add the isogenesis to the cost of what would it cost you to be on isogenesis and a shake a day just replace breakfast remember could changing one meal change your life absolutely we watch it happen all the time um and and people who are skeptical become promoters so uh let's take the price of the shake and the isogenesis and the average person, the studies show that isogenics is done, the average person will save about 100 bucks because you're doing a shake for every meal. It's not just because it's cheaper, it's because your appetite, you lose the cravings and those cravings add up in between meals. The, the chips, the Pringles, the snacks, the Starbucks. Uh, so the average person will save $100, which would pay for this product right here and then some. So. Uh, it's pretty smart to do the shake with the isogenesis because the shake will pay for the isogenesis, right? But let's just add the cost of the two of them together. It's still under the price of this meal back in 2007. That's killing you. Uh, now, I'm not going to say you can't eat a hamburger. I have not had a soda since I've been on isogenics 14 years now. I don't really crave fries, so I don't really eat them. In, in 14 years, how many times have I had fries? Probably a couple dozen. I like the sweet potato fries. Um, but I, I, no soda at all, zero and very minimal on the fries, but I do eat hamburgers. I like them. I know that they're not doing my body any favor. It's more for pleasure when you're eating food out there. Now it's going to be more for pleasure. Um, but you know, I get the nutrition in my body every day. So it takes care of that garbage that I put in it. Um, so, I mean, again, it's a no brainer Five fifty you're gonna save money by being on it and get healthier. So it's 29 bucks to get started. Everybody starts out as a customer. But what I love about it is everybody can get the product at the same price. So you pay your wholesale membership and you can order as much product as you want through your own website. Uh, I had a, a box show up today. It's like Christmas. After 14 years, it's still like Christmas when it shows up. Now, if you wanna share it with other people, you can. It's included in your cost of your being a customer. You can share it with people and it helps the company to grow. And so helping the company to grow, they'll compensate you for that. That we're the advertisers. And advertising could be very expensive for companies. In fact, 80% of a product's cost could be just in the advertising. Pizza, the biggest cost is the box. <laughs> and then the commercials that they have to make to advertise about the pizza. So really the number one cost is the marketing for the pizza. And then isn't that crazy? The box is more expensive than the pizza itself. Um, so the company's really smart in how they advertise. They let the customers do that. And about 15% of the customers will turn into advertisers proactively. Um, you don't have to, but if you want to. But the, products, the product price is the same. I really love that. When I decided I wanted to share it proactively, I was already sharing it and I didn't make a dime. Once I said, hey, there's people that are asking me about this that I... People asked me about it, they got on the product, but they, they didn't get on it through me enrolling them. So I didn't make any money. I didn't get them their own account. And uh, then their friends and family started calling me and it kind of opened my eyes to the power of the product, first of all, and the joy that I got from sharing it and watching their results. And then so I, I became curious as to how could I make some extra income with it? And they said, well, you're already qualified, Dave, with your own order to make money. It's called 100 BV, and you're ordering more than that already, Dave. 100 BV stands for business volume. Well, our Forever Pack, which is a shake every morning for breakfast, two canisters would give you a shake every morning for breakfast. You can pick two flavors. When I got started, it was just chocolate and vanilla. Now they have strawberry, peach mango, chocolate mint, and uh, they just had birthday cake. It's a, it's a seasonal one, and I bought a lot of birthday cake because I didn't know how well that would taste or how good. So we didn't buy as much and we ran out pretty fast because it tasted amazing. And it's the same nutritional shake, right? So um, I bought a lot of it this time. That's what showed up on my doorstep today. Birthday cake, you guys. I get to have birthday cake and be healthy. So you can have your cake and eat it too. <laughs> That's awesome. So this is a shake for breakfast every morning, the breakfast of champions. And this is a month supply. So this is a one month supply. It's a qualified order. And you could make you know, a passive residual income off of helping other people to get started on it. And so they said, look, once you sponsor two people, 
the company will pay you 6% on every order. And when they reorder it, because it's a consumable product, and they'll reorder it because they're going to want to keep ordering it. I still have people ordering product from when I enrolled them 14 years ago. And I get paid 6% every time they order it from 14 years ago. So a, a consultant right there, uh, being that right there, uh, Carrie and I have earned $10 million in the company. And uh, last week was a record week. And the week before that was a record week as well. But last week was the ultimate record week. So um, there's over 300,000 people in my organization now. And it's just amazing, you know, the uh, impact that you can make in people's lives. And so just as, um, uh, as an example, Cindy Talley is a home health nurse who had amazing results on the product. And in one year, she had enrolled 25 customers in one year, but she had 950 people in her organization. So how many people does the company pay her for on product orders? All of them, not just the 25 that she enrolled, all 950. And at that time, she was making about $1,000 a week. That's her personal story, her personal testimony, and her personal results. It's going to differ for everybody. So, um, but $1,000 a week, that was awesome. She retired from being a home health nurse in, in two years. So that's the power of what we have here, you know, helping people with their health. In this case, it helped Cindy with her wealth. Uh, for me and my family, it's dramatically changed our lives in every area. It started out small. You know, I just wanted to take my wife to dinner and a movie. I couldn't do that. We were living from paycheck to paycheck. We didn't have enough money to get through the month. We were maxing out credit cards. So we didn't get to enjoy those kinds of conveniences. My first check, I took my wife out. You know, well, actually, well, I won't go there. Some of you know the story of what I did with my first check. But I was able to take my, start taking my wife to dinner and a movie and buying new clothes for my kids instead of waiting for the cousins to give us hand-me-downs and my kids out growing their clothes, you know? It was, it was a terrible situation and it changed all of that for us. That's how it started out for me, you guys. And then it grew and expanded and became more and more. Um, I just wanna show you how you can actually eat for free. Like you could get this paid for and then some. The company did something that is, like they have promotions, companies have promotions, they just did a promotion that's going to blow your mind. If you're just watching this, like, I'm not asking you to do a, you know, share this proactively, but you've got to know this. What I just showed you about how I got started on the product. So you get started on this forever pack. It's $164, right? And then you have your membership for $29, but the product cost itself is 164 bucks. And uh, so you get started on that. You help two other people to get started on that, the company's gonna give you a $170 bonus. That more than paid for your products. You get started with a forever pack and you help two people, it doesn't matter who they are, but two people that you sponsor. And look, when you decide you wanna go from a customer to being able to share it with other people, it's called an associate, they'll send you a video that you can watch on an email. Cause you have to push a button in your website as a customer and say, hey, I wanna become an associate. There's no cost to it. And you just push the button and they'll send you a video you can watch. It gives you two free codes to waive their membership cost. So they don't have to pay the $29. So once you watch that video on the email they send you when you push that button, once you watch the video, it's only like four minutes, they'll send you another email with the two codes. The two codes, when you enroll these people, will waive their membership cost. So they don't have to pay the $29. They get this forever pack, you just made $170. You didn't pay anything for the product. You made 10, well, six bucks. This is how the company, they understand it, they get it, right? They know that this is an investment that they're making. I don't know if they lose money on it, but they're not making a whole lot of money right here when they're paying you that, but they know that you're gonna love the products and you're gonna keep ordering them. So now what if these two people wanted to do the same thing? Cause they can watch this. They do the same thing. That person just made $170. That person just made $170. And guess what that does for you? You make an additional $450 just because they did what you did. Talk about growing a company. Yeah, this is accelerating it. It was already accelerated just because we're now 
you know, enough people are on this product and getting the results that there's enough people that now it creates that critical mass. This is throwing it into a turbocharge. You just made $620. These people got their product for free. You got your product for free. And now because they got their product for free, you just made another 450. It's a total of $620, you guys. It's, I, I, you know, I, I get it. I, I, companies do promotions and a lot of times the, re, the return doesn't come back on their investment. You know, there's a risk in doing promotions. I absolutely believe that this is gonna be the best promotion they've ever done and that they'll keep going. They're doing this until September right now. They just, it's a promotion, but if it works great, they're gonna keep it going. So you don't have to do this. You can get on the products and just be a product user, but I, I just wouldn't know why you wouldn't wanna help. I mean, based on the science, on a scale of one to 10, how much do you believe the people that you know would wanna know about telomeres on a scale of one to 10? Let's say one, no, they wouldn't wanna know about telomeres and how that's gonna impact their health. Or 10, yeah, they would totally wanna to know about telomeres and how it's gonna impact their health. We'll send them to foreverpack.com and let them decide, right? and uh, they want to get started, then you can see how this process would, would take place. So I'm just going to end it right there and, and just say, get back to the person that got you started or, or that got you here and let them help you get started. If you have some additional questions, they can help you answer those. Just get them the information. They just need your name and shipping and then your payment method. They'll set you up the account. The product shipped directly to you right from the company. And now you have your own website. And uh, you can do what you want with that. You can order as much products as you want. And then you can also enroll other people if you want to, if you just push that button that says associate and you can waive their membership for the first two people. So thank you for allowing me to share my passion and Jojo, you know, just in closing, you know, you know, whatever you feel is on your heart. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you for all of the information tonight. It was great to have all you guys on and, um, you you know in your gut whether or not you feel this is right for you. I mean, the science is there. The clinical studies are there. If you want to read more about the clinical studies, you can go to isogenicshealth.net. There's, there's the clinical studies are there. You can read all of them. Um, we're a very transparent company, so we keep <laughs> everything on the open. So um, go to foreverpack.com and, and send some people there. And um, we're here every Monday. And invite somebody next week. Yeah, let me just right. unmute Guillermo. Hey, Guillermo, I, I can see you there. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to put you on the spot. You've been on the products for just a little over a month. And uh, you started out on the Forever Pack. And then you kind of grown the product line in, into your, you know, your daily routine. But, you know, kind of what happened for you right in the beginning that you noticed? And then, you know, where, where are you at now? You know, I think what's it been about six weeks for you? Yeah, it's been 40, 41 days. 41 days. 41 days um man um I, I first started um with with the um isogenesis and um my back pain went away in about three days and i'm a, I'm a pretty big boy and uh, obviously everybody said because of my weight in three days i didn't lose any weight but the, the 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 product stopped my back pain very very quickly so it was a lot easier to walk and everything like that then when i then i got my shakes and everything and um i've lost 31 pounds so far uh, 31 pounds. I test. I tested my um, alkaline. I'm at a 7.5, and that happened just in that happened just in one month. And right now, I'm up to 24 inches lost in my body. So, um, man, <laughs> I've, I've never. And I feel so much energy. Um, I was like I said, I was in the gym yesterday, man. I just kept looking for other stuff to do because I had so much energy. And I went to the gym twice yesterday. I went in the morning and then. Um, at 10 o'clock at night, I was at the gym. So um, I, I, I have so much energy. Uh, the weight is coming off very quickly. And before, when I've lost weight, I felt so weak. Like I just, I just burnt myself out. And this time, man, this is, this is amazing. I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm ecstatic. I mean, my body is responding. Like I go to work, people tell me, "What are you doing?" You know. So it, it's very noticeable. And I, I thank God that Willie talked to me and. Uh, I'm not, I'm not going nowhere. I can't wait to get to Tennessee. And if you're looking at this for the first time, I'm living proof because I was one of those people that 
I, I was tired of trying to lose weight. I mean, I was literally tired. And, and I can tell you that I truly believe that this thing saved my life. I truly believe that. I can say the same thing for myself too. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, you're building a team around this already too. You've had, you hit that, those bonuses that I showed there and you have people on your team that have hit those bonuses. This is a very easy product to, to share. It's a very easy program. I mean, my grandkids do it, right? So, I mean, it's very simple to do, but the results are so profound. So I, I appreciate you Let me put you on the spot like that. Um, so you guys just get back with the person that got you here and we do this every Monday night. And again, you can go to foreverpack.com and, and access it there. And uh, just uh, thank you for being with us today. Was there any questions that we needed to address, Jojo, on the chat? I, I think I addressed them all. So um, if there's anything left, sorry, but I think I touched on everything. Yeah, we have a whole community around this. It's not like you just get products and then we forget about you. Even if you're, just, even if you're a customer and that's all you want to be, we have... Facebook groups, we have this environment and this culture where people can become a part of, and it's really like a family. And I just, yeah, exactly, right? That's, the, my best friends are in isogenics now. And uh, I, I have something to get up for every morning. And we have great things to talk about and things to celebrate rather than things to complain about, you guys. It's a huge difference. I th it's another reason why I call it bringing heaven to earth. I truly believe that this is a, a catalyst for facilitating that. And our biggest company event of the year is coming up in Tennessee. You're totally invited to come to that and join 15,000 people who are all healthy. I mean, that's a testimony for a lot of people when they go to the events and they see how healthy and glowing people are. Um, it's just, a, it's something that you just notice. And, uh, you know, so you're welcome to come to that. It's a three-day event on August 10th, 11th, and 12th. And uh, you can come to that and just see the community, learn more about it, and, uh, you know, uh, and get involved with something that's a movement. And it's a worthwhile movement. It's strategic alignments, you guys. We all choose the things we're going to align ourselves with. And sometimes we pick careers or get forced into careers that really isn't alignments that serve us. And I'm just going to tell you, the more you align yourself with isogenics as a culture and as an environment on whatever level, but the more you do that, the more fun and the more exhilarating and the more enthusiastic and the more purpose-driven your life becomes. So uh, I love sharing that. I'm grateful for the company and all that it's done for me and my family. So with that, you guys have a great week and uh, God bless and, and thanks for joining us tonight. Bye, Thanks, everyone. everyone. Thanks for telling us your